Hi guys, this is Craig with Loftus. I'm going to show you a proper inflation of a foil balloon. Now, one thing you need to know about a foil balloon, you don't want to use the latex tilt valve to blow up a foil. You're going to be blowing too much helium in there too fast and you can damage the valve. That will make it so your balloon will not last. Use the foil valve and you want to, in on that there is a little like a little hole that you want to slide onto the foil valve and just push up. What the foil valve does is it measures the pressure going into the balloon. So when it feels that the balloon is full, it stops. You cannot pop the balloon. So, so as you see, I'm still pulling up on it and it has stopped. It's not putting any more helium inside of it. So pull it off at that point. On the tail, there's a little line and pretty much all balloons have that nowadays. It says tie ribbon here. You want to make sure you tie the ribbon at that point. What it does is it's below the hole where you fill it so you're not tying over the valve. When you tie over the valve, it crimps it and it makes it so your helium will leak. So you do not want to do that. Plus, another great thing is if you have to reinflate it, you can get right inside of it. You don't have to worry about it. So let's put a ribbon on here. You see the hole's still exposed. I put six feet of string on there because I'm six feet tall. Take a weight that will hold the balloon down. If it doesn't hold the balloon down, it's not really a weight. All right. And you're good to go.